Oh, are you going to do it? Yeah. Oh, no. You know what? My husband and uh, my daughter are waiting for me. Oh. But you know what? How fast? Pretty fast. All right. Let's okay. Go. So hold on. Let's just take a picture. Okay. Kai, you want to get a text? Can I surprise you? Is it working? Oh, yeah. Pause. Okay. That makes tattoo number three for me. How about you? Hello, and welcome to VegFest 2023. VegFest 2023 was held at Grange Park. I'm quick just gonna walk around the ground so you could see all of the tents and businesses that were set up. It did happen to be the weekend that we were expecting Hurricane Lee, so the turnout was really low. Based on the, the tables and seating, I think they were expecting a lot more people. And the weather ended up being fabulous. It was so beautiful outside that day. They had a pretty full day plan with demos, vendors, entertainment, and speakers. I was able to get a video of one of the demonstrations where Chef Sunshine prepared vegan scallops. So hold to the end to see that. After Chef Sunshine's presentation, there was a presentation from Sato Salon where they were going to do a facial and I'm so mad that I didn't get to see it, but I promised them that I would come and I'm actually going to make my appointment today that I'm doing this video because it was a great reminder. Mm -hmm. 
welcome and thank you for stopping by for this cooking demonstration. My name is Chef Sunshine from Sunny's Vegan Kitchen. They also call me the vegan snob. Why snob? Because I'm snobby about my food. I think vegan food should be tasty, wonderful, delicious. I'm going to be using king oyster mushrooms. It's also called trumpet mushrooms. I promise you I can get it out of this bag. <laughs> so if you've never seen king oyster mushrooms, this is how it looks. It's the king oyster mushroom, which you can use in a lot of different recipes. It can substitute things like chicken, it can substitute shrimp. It can do basically anything because it takes on the flavor. Whatever seasonings you're using, it kind of soaks in that seasoning. So, for the king oyster mushroom scallop, what I'm going to do is cut off the top and the bottom. And you can always save that for something else later, but for today, I'm just going to discard it. I'm going to cut off the top. And then it will look like this. And so just like scallops, if you've ever, you know, I'm not sure who has been vegan all their life, but scallops are ever seen a scallop, but you want to do them, do them in a circular shape. And another thing with king oyster mushrooms, when you're trying to do it in a scallop type of um, recipe, you don't want to cook them too long. So it's something that's really quick if you have them in your home or you know you see them and you're coming home late and you want something for the family, this is a quick, easy meal. It takes about 15 minutes. Okay. Then I'm just going to cut into them just lightly. I'm not going to go in too much because you don't want to pierce it. You just want to kind of make a little shape here, like tic-tac-toe. <laughs> and then you do them on both sides. And this is also great so when you put it in the butter garlic sauce, it's going to soak in all that um, flavor, all that good flavor. Um, olive oil, just a little. Now inside this bag is nori, nori seeds, what you can use for um, sushi and things of that nature. So if you want to give it a fishy taste, something that's similar to it. So you can just put a little in there. And then you just let that sit in there. Kind of spin it around in there so they can get evenly coated. Some ghost flakes also to give it a little and help. Just, just a little I put in here. If you're interested in this recipe, my website, Sunny Vegan Kitchen, you can get it there. It's, it's all there. Well, I um, had a health care. Well, not a health care. I'm a cancer survivor. Here's a look at the finished product. King oyster mushrooms as scallops. 
pretty tasty too. My name is Tiffany Nelson. I am a resident and a realtor here in the Lehigh Valley. If you need a realtor, please give me a call. I would love to hear from you. Thanks so much for watching. Let me find something else for you to watch if you like this one. Hmm, what would be a good fit? I'll think about it and put something here. Have a good day.